What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is Craft the Source and welcome back to another gameplay episode of the Jurassic World Evolution Challenge Mode. So as you can see here, we're actually off to a really good start because we got our very own, well, first dinosaur zone to start out with. And, and yes, uh, turns out that the rains here are actually, well, sort of coming together. Well, they like the facility rains like through the roof while the dinosaur rain. Well, kind of so needs work. <sighs> and even though I kind of do need to put down at least either 16 dinosaurs total or more than enough mods in order to really get things underway. But today, though, I want to try to like really go after the, uh, the one dinosaur we still haven't exactly bred yet, and that would be the Diplodocus. Hmm. Well, even though there's still some dinosaurs we could still try to go for, but yeah, however though, we don't exactly love time in order to do that, so. Hmm. No, in fact, I'm not too sure which one dinosaur to go for. Hmm. We could probably try to go for another suit of ceratops, but eh. Hmm. I don't know, more. Maybe Aladar. Hmm. Uh, dinosaurs, we already got a small report to start out with. You know what? Let's go for Baryonyx. You know, just to, uh, really be sure about it. Hmm. Now. I don't know if I should probably try to put the, uh, the podcast enclosure right over here. But... No, wait. Uh. Wait. That's right. I think it only mostly goes for, like, uh, a grassland kind of uh, habitat. <laughs> Believe me, I may not know oh, too much well about park designs. But I really am trying to do the best as I possibly can. Now let's see if we can get rid of all this water just to start out with. And let's see what we got from here. Now, however though, the terrain around here eh, may not be in the most uh, pleasurable. Well, but I am really, I'm trying to really smooth in the area as best as I possibly can. All right. Hmm. Okay, there we go. So, uh, hmm. Let's see. Well, I guess I, I could try to give it a... Hmm, how flat is this area? Uh, okay, not... Ah, here we go! Oh, one Baryonyx is going to start out with. And... Let's see. Oh, ah, uh, hold on. I may have to give her the, the tree really quick. Just to see if, how it really works. Well, even though this is going to cost me a lot of money, but... At least it should be worth it though, right? <laughs> well, we still need to... Well, do this pretty fast, or else we'll, uh, once again lose the challenge. Alright, there we go. Trees all... all moved. Oh, is that one last bit? And... Hmm. Wow, we actually do have, like, plenty of room. Hmm, now, like I said, may not be a really good, well, designer, but <laughs> I am going to try to do the best as possible to it. <gasps> oh, you know what? Uh, I may have a small idea. Okay, maybe if I go under here and... Oh, boy. Huh. <sighs> Of course, it's uh, a little too big, but uh, hmm, I don't know. I could try to use this just to help the viewers get to see the dinosaurs a little better. But hmm, you know what? Uh, maybe I'll try to find a better spot for it and later. Right now, I'm just gonna try to really get things. Uh, Around here, like so. 
Uh, uh, oh well. Hmm, maybe I could probably put like a large herbivore exhibit, like somewhere around here. Just to really see how well it's really gonna look. Eh, uh, come on, just go really. Hmm, let's see. Hmm, well, I don't want to try to put the substation inside the enclosure or else it's gonna turn out to be a little <laughs> weird. Okay, maybe like right about there. Well, at least it's a decent size. Now I hope it there be enough room just to put down the... Oh, how do you like that? Just about enough room. <laughs> For sorts. <laughs> um, I don't know, would that even... Oh, but the fence though. Um, okay, yeah. I'll probably put it like right about there. Hmm. But at least it'll be more than big enough just to really place out like a viewing bed of some sort. Or a viewing gallery, as I should say. <laughs> well, I don't know where the heck that even came from. Hmm. Now, uh, let's see. Oh boy. And we are starting to. Oh boy, uh, yeah, I may have to. Uh, whew, wow, okay. Looks like we are really getting really distracted, like, <laughs> with this research. Hmm, I don't know, can I possibly upgrade the... Okay, yeah, that's not... I won't be good at all. Oh. Uh, path not connected. What? Uh. Let's see. Uh, I could try to do it like that, and. Well, may not be perfectly straight, but oh well. There we go. Of course, I. You do have the substation onto here. Wait, how far is Ah of course. Not even close. Eh, I'll probably put like right there for now. Oh boy, um and I can tell. Oh boy. Yep. Of course that was gonna end not too well. Okay, this is <laughs> This is actually really not looking too well for me, isn't it? Hmm. Now how much of the uh Huh five hundred thousand. That was a very something like that. Just gonna say it. Hmm. Okay, so I guess I'm going to have to put like a small station, well, small power station somewhere in this area. And hmm. Now, however, in the meantime, let's see. Uh. Okay, everyone. Okay, as long as everyone's doing well. Aha! With the Platicus! Wow! Just at 50%? How do you like that? Hmm. Hmm. And now, unless I could probably try to make this into like of a mix between 
Wait a minute. I have an idea. What if I could somehow turn this one into like a a, uh, a carnivore enclosure while I make this one into like a, a nice looking uh, herbivore enclosure. After all, carnivores don't even need a lot of room anyway. You know what? And speaking of carnivores. Hmm. Oh, uh, you know what? Let me just check out the research. Uh, let's see. Ah, still need. Yep, still need one star, which is still not good. Huh. And I don't know why so many studio miners are hanging around in the forest. Okay, here they come. Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, right, <laughs> the uh, expedition. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Power, small, small power station, and like right about there. There we go. <laughs> Okay, by the time that's done, we should be able to read our very own Diplodocus in no time. <gasps> oh! You know what? I think I just... Uh... Let's see, enclosures... Oh, perfect! I... Unless I could probably put like a viewing gap... No, wait, uh... Let's see... Viewing platform. I could probably try to do that since I never had the chance to know what to really place it down back in the, uh, well, first challenge I had to go through. <laughs> Which was kind of a little bit disappointing. Alright, come on, any time now. There we go. Uh, expedition completed. And, ooh, dice of eggs. Ah, uh, well, that site's completely depleted, so. Alright, let's take a look at the plugins and see what we got. Hmm, come think of it. I think I've never even seen this thing under its, uh, well, under a different color pattern, so. There we go. I guess we'll probably deal with this for now. But before we start incubating, I'm gonna try to wait until the, well, fossils are actually done. Let's see. That's it. Come on. Just a little bit more and nice. Okay. Go. Whoa! <laughs> Man, how you like that? Just in time. There we go. <laughs> hmm. Well, looks like the heaven foundation is really starting to give out a bit of a toll on my park, so. Hmm. No, oh, come to think of it. Uh, I should probably really you know, work out with the uh, environment in the meantime. I guess I'll probably put back some of the trees like, that weren't uh, before. So, like, uh, yeah, like, a few trees, like, oh, oopsies, <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> realize, yeah, just add, like, a few trees here and there, just to really, really have a look, hmm, Oh, and uh, the water as well, which I gotta put that down somewhere. <gasps> oh, uh, hold on. Can you, like, right up, like, right about in this area. There we go. Haha, <laughs> a nice little 
A little drinking hole for the Diplarcus themselves. Hmm. Well, it may not be like the biggest looking one, but I'm pretty sure where we are really looking forward to. Hmm. You know what? Come to think of it, while we're while we are oh, wait for ah too expensive. Um, let's see. Oh, wait. Ah, <laughs> duh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was looking at the, uh, the block of zoom <laughs> price. Okay, uh. Yeah, I may have to really keep an eye out for, like, uh, more. What should I say? Hmm. Wow. Okay, honestly, I really did not think this one would completely through. Hmm. Wow. You know what? Let me take a look at the, uh, guess. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, not to. Okay, all I need is to put. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, okay, so I need, all I gotta do now is shrink the, uh, the suit of Mimus and sell that thing for a good amount of bucks. Yeah, I think it's this one. Look at that. Oh, almost. Really? Uh, there we go. Haha! <laughs> Nighty night! Okay, that should really do it. Well, it's just to really get the, uh. Well. Okay, uh. Hmm. Really, is that it? No, I'll probably stop it for like right about there for now. Besides, you can't really still need more money anyhow. <laughs> Alright, as soon as that you know, the Omimus actually hits out of the park, that'll be yet another mission. Mission that'll be done. You know what? And, you no, know, speaking of research. Uh, hmm. Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Enclosures. Huh, yeah, of course I. Keep up this kind of work, and you'll be going places. Well, I hope so. Alright, since we got at least enough money just to breed the one Diplicus, let's get on the roll. Alright, there we go. Oh, shoot! Uh, I just realized something there. Word is that a new contract is available. Huh. Yeah, of course. Every opportunity comes with risks. For now, you've done the first. That is a job well done. Uh, thank you. Everybody says you can handle yourself, so this new contract should be a cakewalk, right? I hope so. <laughs> well, at least not. Good thing I can still be a small urban boy, though. But I prefer not to do it right now in the meantime. Speaking of which, uh... Okay, well, at least these guys are... Just, you could be able to just, you know, live, uh... Yeah, and I even just realized that I had to put down on the herbivore feeder. I'll probably put it like right about there. For now. <gasps> and I keep up again. The one most important thing I really need to put down. 
Hmm. Uh, oh, uh. What? Yeah, like right about there. <laughs> uh oh. Alright. Uh, okay, no problem. Well, since this is under medium difficulty, I should be able to uh, cure that and should be a minus with these. There we go. <laughs> Done and done. All right. By the time this diplodocus is done, we should be able to breed it. Yeah. Well, I'm just really hoping that diplodocus could really help me out with the uh, financial. Well, debates. And besides, <laughs> with the uh. Oh, hello. Hmm. Now I kind of have a feeling maybe I should move the uh. Uh. Well, we should move the watering hole right nearby the uh. Well. <sighs> hmm. And now the crowd kind of does look a bit. Plainish. So, what if I could try to? Yeah, you know, a little, a little bit of uh, well, grasslands and other stuff like. Ah, okay, there we go. <laughs> you know, I feel like I shouldn't even put down too many trees, but. Oops. Arr. Of course I... Uh, there we go. There we go. Alright, nice! A very onyx is uh, ready for... Or you could bang. Aw oh, man, then I got nothing. Hey, with the first deploy, guess so. I should be able to get myself more money than usual. Hmm, no, kind of think of it. I'm actually, actually doing pretty good so far. Hmm. Now, I know I feel like I haven't, like, done, like, too much of... Oh? Huh, okay. <laughs> I really thought they were running for their lives for a second, but... <laughs> but with no carnivores yet? Hmm, come to think of it. How well is... Okay, so... Yeah! Okay, here's the deal. So I'll try to transfer the... Shithio... Mimus over to this enclosure... Here with the... Uh, with six, six Diplodocus in there. Here, so that way I can be able to really like uh oh there we go so that way i could be able to have a better chance to increase the rains just a little more hmm huh 66,000 huh wow so much for 70,000 but, at least all that is about to change soon enough. Just gotta... <laughs> Come on! It could be faster! It could be, it could be, it could be fall off faster! <laughs> hmm... But, yeah. Uh, another quick look at the research won't hurt, so... Yeah, I'll probably leave some of the... Fossils that big, just in case. Hmm. As much as I don't want to try to spend too much money, but huh, sometimes you guys spend money in order to make tons of it. <laughs> ah, here we go! 
Oh, but first... Wow, still no luck with the minerals, huh? Hmm. But anywho, ladies and gentlemen, I introduce you once again, Dr. Plodicus. I'd say I'm surprised, but that wouldn't be the truth. I knew you'd get your park rating up, and you continue to prove me right. So, I guess this is a pat on the back for us both. Well, that's only one star in the four to go. <laughs> okay, man, look at this magnificent beauty. I wouldn't give in order to really have a look one up at really close. Oh gosh, it's just so beautiful! Diplodocus. It's fun, right? Diplodocus. I mean, the name, Diplodocus. It's fun to say. Oh, sure, yeah, it is. Okay, what do we got? There we go. Oh, you know what? As. Yeah, speaking of. Who? Ah, one million dollars. I forgot it cost that much just to research it. But hey, since we got. You know, one to pluck is out of the field. We should be able to make at least a little more money than ever. Okay, here we go. Now these guys are really starting to come right in. Huh. Well, doing better so far. Hmm. Now, let's see. Aw, oh, man, what happened to my... Oh, shoot, the capacity. Uh, okay. Well, I guess we could probably put down at least one hotel. Well, just to be sure. Which I have no money on whatsoever. Think of which. How much power do I. Oops. <laughs> How much power do I have right now, anyway? 50. Okay, so. Ah, oh, come on. Usually, you actually go for like a lot of minerals or something. Hmm. Um, let's see. What? Let me see if I can switch back to the Plagueis, just in case. Hmm. Huh. Well, I guess this Aerid skin pattern doesn't exactly show a lot, but... Hey! Since we got ourselves a first silver pod into the park, so... Our range should be able to really... You know, go straight up through the roof. Hmm. Okay, just... Ooh, plus I even found a good amount of fossils. Let's see, Carnotaurus, Sinoceratops, Procerasaurus, Critinosaurus, Archaeornithomimus, Dreadnoughtus, and Albertosaurus. Hmm. Well, and there's a rotten source, of course. <laughs> Lord Titan. <laughs> hmm. Now, it's so weird that these two are not even part of the Claire. Well, I mean, like, they're not even in a separate category. But hey. Oh, poo. I thought it was gonna be more minerals this time. Ah, well. Okay, so at least we got all that. It's going pretty well, so, uh, yeah, um, how much time do we have? Well, I think we, <sighs> I'm just hopefully, and I mean hopefully, we should be able to get this done before we reach the part time. So, thank you so much for watching today's video, ladies and gentlemen, and hopefully we should be able to end a brand new dinosaur species sometime soon, but we'll get to see what happens soon enough. If you really did enjoy this video, then be sure to leave a like and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more awesome, terrific videos like this. And be sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter and hit the little bell to get notified about my newest and latest videos. And I'll be seeing all you 
lovely people with the, the next episode. Peace out.